start praying. We keep praying. The church wants to use prayer to accomplish everything. We start praying. Soon there will be prayer points in all the churches. But we are not encouraging our own to go and contest. Contest and fail. Go again. When the righteous is in authority. So we say that politics is a dirty game. Politics, who made it dirty? Dirty men. Because clean men allow dirty men to get there. Go join a political party. Start from the world level. There will be a political revival. When the righteous comes to authority. Imagine policies. If the righteous is not there, don't complain about any policy that is made against the church. Yes. Don't tell me how they put Quranic sign in money. Don't tell me how they put all manner of things. There are legislations against us. Against the church. Don't keep bemoaning about that. What is the church doing? Is the church encouraging her own to go out there and then rule in stratas and spheres and parastatas of the society? When the righteous is in authority, the people rejoice. Are there Christian lawyers? Are there Christian doctors? I went to a particular hospital where one of someone I know, I knew, died. It was a coven. And the family said, around, I saw everything that happened. I said, tell me what happened here by past one. They say it was the one that the husband came and entered into a room with the, with the, with the doctor. And then they stayed there for hours. Coming out again, the woman was confirmed dead. The woman spoke, the woman ate, did everything. Of course, you know, an Oboni man will always go to an Oboni hospital. That's how they took the woman, caught her in a mirror. She showed up and then her life was extinguished. Listen to me. Christians should not be in the church only. In fact, our exploit is not in the church. The church is a workshop. The church is a tool shop. When I mean tool, it's a place where we get sharpened. But the exploit is not here. Matthew 5 and verse number 13. He says you are the salt of the world, not the church. You are the light of the world, not the church. Too many lights in church. People that should become politicians in the world have now come striving to become men's leader. Year in, year out, there is politics. Take that politics out of the church. Go and be the leader of your community. Too many lights in the church. Imagine when you take salt of 15,000 and put in one pot of soup. Nobody will eat it. Too many salt in the church. That's why the tongue of the church has caught because we can't speak anymore. You are the light of the world. Go ye into the world and have 